Good morning, guys. How you doing? It's me, Davey Z here. You know, I've been married for 17 years to Sean, and when you got a wife, there's an old saying, happy wife, happy life, okay? My wife has worked hard her whole life. She works for a local supermarket and corporate. She's been there for uh, 32 years. And her job just got cut in half because of cutbacks. And, uh, you know, we took a big hit monetarily. That's why I'm stepping up my business a little bit again. Um, and Sean, every morning for the last 30 years, has been getting up at 3.45 a.m., in the shower, dressed, dogs fed, dogs out, things like that, you know, just the morning thing. But every day since I've known her, 3.45 a.m. she's getting up, and she's getting ready for work, and she works, she gets it. She never had to be to work realistically till 8 o'clock, but she'd get there at 6 a.m. and work till like 5, 5.30 for all these years. Finally, you know, she stopped doing that. Now she's working part-time. She works uh, five hours a day, four days a week, five days a week, something like that, at a good rate of pay. So it, it, it was a big hit, but we, we, she's still comp compensated for what she does very well, and the benefits are good. But every morning she gets up at 3.45 a.m., and her biggest thing was, where am I going to sit and put my makeup on? So we moved back to the house, and I ended up moving things around and rearranging the bathroom and reconstructing things to where now Sean has her own little makeup closet. It's a room about, I think it's uh, six by four. Six by four, and it is perfect for what she needs it for. So I want to show you what I made. I made her this little table that goes up against the wall the one wall in her makeup room is a big mirror. It's like mirror panels, and it's really cool. I mean, you could stand up, you could see her whole body, whatever. And she's gonna use that mirror, so I built her a little makeup table, like a little desk, and I'm gonna put a little power, what the hell was that? Power connection on it, so she can plug it in and have all of her, you know, her hair dryer, her curling iron, all that stuff that women use um, right at her disposal. So what I did was I went and got some lumber, I put it together, and this is what I created for my lovely wife. Now it's going to be white, but it's got a nice little insert here so she could put like a hairbrush in there, her comb, you know, whatever, makeup, keep it in there. And she could use the desktop here to put it on, and behind here the mirror will be there. Now she'll be sitting up here so her face will be perfectly in the mirror. So now, guys, if you're married... I got to tell you, like I said earlier, happy wife, happy life. This kind of stuff makes my wife happy. My wife is easy to please. She, uh, she's, a, she's a perfect person. Uh, the littlest things from the dollar store mean more to her than something you could buy at uh, the top of the line jewelry store here in Western New York. Uh, that's just how Sean is. She loves the little things and simple things in life and when she saw this yesterday after I constructed it before I primed it she was like flipping out how cool it is how lovely how beautiful this and that. you know I'm like son it's just a little desk but it came out nice I did have one flaw in it that I noticed um, right here if you look at it straight on this leg you can see that it's not lined up good but other than that everything came out nice and there's a little foot rest Right here, you can see that board there, that I'm going to place from here to here so she could put her foot on there. Now the chair she's going to be using is this red, this little red and cream colored thing. i got to clean it up. It's a little dirty. So this is going to be a cream colored white, antique white, with the footrest being red. And maybe just a little detail right here in red. I'm thinking about like this piece, this this and a little crown here. Everything else will be white. So it'll be two-tone with a foot rest. I'm going to do it in um, oil-based paint. I always use oil on little you know, pieces of furniture because it gives you a much better finish. So I've got this old quart of Sherwin Dub Sherwin Williams product that I used on a job years ago. And um, 
that is going to be my paint. It's white. I also have a fresher thing of, uh, where the hell did it go? Bear oil based paint. Now, I've never used bear oil. I'm sure it's just as good. Bear's got a good product. But, uh, I, you know, I'm a, I'm a stickler for Cheryl Williams, so that's probably what I'm going to use. We'll see if one of them's better than the other. You know, one might be loaded with junk. I'm going to have to strain it, and uh, that'll help me get it ready. But that's the, that's the deal, guys. So that's all I got to say. Happy wife, happy life. I hope you're having a great day. I hope your holiday was good. I'm sure you had a great New Year's. Um, and you know what? Everybody have a great day, and I love you. Picking up my flyer in a couple weeks, so I'll be having that back here, and I got training coming up in March. So uh, we're all set with that. And what else? <clears throat> That's about it. I hope you had a great holiday. Happy New Year, and may 2020 be your best year ever. I'm Davey Z, and I'm out of here.